This store on the screen right now generated over $300,000 and the variety of other stores I'm also showing you did very similar figures and they did this by utilizing digital patterns. And no, you do not need to be a graphic designer to utilize this. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do this in today's video by using AI. Now let's break down the idea of a digital pattern that is very simply a design that has been created by someone or something that is then gone on and sold by individuals or businesses for a variety of purposes. Now when I say using AI, I'm speaking specifically about Midjourney, which is a generative artificial intelligence platform. We can go ahead and provide a prompt to to go ahead and generate these images. Now when it comes to selling digital patterns individually, there are a ton of upsides to this. There's no labor cost, there's no major upfront cost, and there's a ton of versatility because of the fact that you can just change your prompt and generate different type of images instantly. Now with this large amount of upside, there is a bit of downside when it comes to selling digital patterns individually and that is that the selling price for these digital patterns are quite low because of the fact that you're selling a pattern and not a product. Therefore, you need to go ahead and price these patterns pretty low and you need to sell a high amount to go ahead and profit a large amount. And paired with that, when you're generating these images, it comes down to your prompt. So Mid Journey will generate the image based on your prompt. And if you don't know how to prompt properly, you will get images that can't be used by your business or very simply are poor in quality. I will be showcasing Mid Journey in today's video. However, if you want a starter's guide to Mid Journey, I have written up a PDF which includes what Mid Journey is, how to use it, all the variety of settings, and 30 plus high quality prompts so you can see the prompt you can see what it results in and you can go and utilize it for your own business but moving on I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and increase your profit margins so originally we were talking about selling digital patterns however what if we use those digital patterns to put it onto products and then you can sell the actual products now that is what a lot of these stores are doing that I showed you at the beginning of the video now very simply what these businesses are doing are creating the digital patterns and then putting on products like water bars like cause jackets t-shirts and then justifying a high in selling price therefore creating a larger profit margin for themselves for example this store on the screen right now is taking a digital pattern and putting it onto physical products and then selling it for a large amount of revenue now what is important to note is when it comes to this type of business model it is very important to use high quality patterns and to ensure that the patterns are designed well therefore you can convert more sales and make more revenue for yourself now i'm going to showcase how to use mid journey to go ahead and generate your own digital patterns and what you want to go and do is click the link down below it will take you to their discord once you come to their discord you will join one of the chats as you can see on screen and all you want to do is do slash imagine and then you can go ahead and type in your prompt in the available box now when you're writing your prompt you need to have a vivid understanding about what you're asking for and therefore convert that into your prompt the more details you are the more details the mid journey technology has to go ahead and generate your digital pattern now if you're struggling to understand what type of pattern you should be generating go ahead and look at the etsy top sellers and look at the patterns they're utilizing make some notes on it go ahead and create some prompts based on those notes so you can understand how mid journey works and you can understand what patterns convert the best so i've gone ahead and typed up my prompt and at the end of the prompt i have mentioned dash dash tile which will tell mid journey to create a repeating pattern because that is what we want here once you go ahead and type in your prompt this is what the result is going to look like you will see four images and two rows of buttons so you can go ahead and examine the images see if it fits your business and see if you're happy with the result if you're not there are a few things to go ahead and mention here the first thing is the versions now the version numbers will go ahead and create you an altered version of the existing images now it won't be completely different well will be altered so you can go ahead and see a different version of those images now the second thing you can do here is go ahead and upscale the images based on the number you select i put numbers on the actual images so you can go ahead and match the buttons but when you upscale a given image it will make it higher resolution and provide you with that so you can go ahead and utilize that and the third and final thing you can do here is use the looping arrow to go ahead and re-roll these images and generate them completely again from scratch so you can get different results now once you're happy with the digital pattern you have generated head over to printify and go ahead and select the products you want to put your digital pattern onto once you've gone ahead and done that you can take the products and begin selling them on your stores and getting a large amount of profit now that concludes the video however if you want an in-depth tutorial on how to go ahead and generate the best looking digital patents to then put them on products on printify and then sell them drop a like let me know down below in the comments subscribe if you guys are new and once again you can go ahead and check out my mid journey pdf that shows the complete basics how to go ahead and use it all these settings and the best prompts as well i'm going to catch you guys next time